Hello, my primary friends. Welcome to Singing Time. This week, you will need this list of words that I want you to cut out each word. We'll be using that to sing, I know that my Savior loves me. I've included this in your email and also as a link to a PDF below the show description. You'll also need two paper plates, which we will be using to sing, Families Can Be Together Forever. Today we have a special snack that we will be making, and these are the ingredients that you'll need for that. You'll need some string cheese, some little chocolate chips, some sliced almonds, and some strawberries. Those are the supplies you'll need for our snack. Alrighty, I'm super excited for today and I'm so glad you're here with me. Let's get going. Families can be together forever. You'll need your two paper plates for this song. The pattern goes like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's sing it. I have a family here on earth. They are so good to me. I want to share my life with them through all eternity. Here's our next pattern. One, two, three, four, hit, shimmer. One, two, three, four, hit, shimmer. Here we go. Families can be together forever through Heavenly Father's plan. I always want to be with my own family. And the Lord has shown me how I can. The Lord has shown me how I can. Shimmer. Okay, let's try that without stopping. And then we'll try to do it a little faster. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then we go one, two, three, four, hit, shimmer. One, two, three, four, hit, shimmer. Here we go. I have a family here on earth. They are so good to me. I want to share my life with them through all eternity. Families can be together forever through Heavenly Father's plan. I always want to be with my own family. And the Lord has shown me how I can. The Lord has shown me how I can shiver. Do you think you can do it a little faster? I'm not sure if I can do it a little faster, but let's try together. We've got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, hit, shimmer. One, two, three, four, hit, shimmer. Okay, let's try it out. I have a family here on earth. They are so good to me. I want to share my life with them through all eternity. Families can be together forever through Heavenly Father's plan. I always want to be with my own family. And the Lord has shown me how I can. The Lord has shown me how I can. Shimmer. Whew, that was a good workout. Well done. Reverently, quietly, lovingly, we think of thee. Our next song is Reverently, Quietly. Now we've learned some sign language slash actions to go with this song. And this week I wanted to tell you a story about a little girl named Charlie. 
Now, Charlie loved going to church. She loved primary singing time, of course. What's not to like? And she loved her primary lessons. And she loved seeing all of her friends and her teachers. She even loved sitting with her family during sacrament time. But Charlie also loved to move and to wiggle and to dance and to sing and to play. So sacrament was kind of hard for her sometimes because her mommy and daddy were always saying, shh, be quiet, be quiet. And Charlie thought, I just can't be quiet and sit still for this long. But she knew the most important thing to be still and quiet for was the actual sacrament. When she ate little pieces of bread and she drank from little cups of water, and that was to help her to remember Jesus Christ. And she had just been baptized. So she was especially excited to take the sacrament and, and to think of her baptism because she remembered that her grandpa told her that when she took the sacrament, it was like a time to remember her baptism day and the promises that she had made when she got baptized. So one Sunday, she was sitting there with her family and waiting patiently for the sacrament. They sang the hymn and she sang along because she could read some of the words in the hymn book now. And then it was time to say the prayer over the bread, the little tiny pieces of bread. And she liked thinking of those little tiny pieces. Soon the boys started to pass around the little platters or trays with the pieces of bread. And Charlie's little brother, Alex, poked her in the side. And Charlie looked at him and she really wanted to say, cut it out, like she did at home. But she remembered she was in church and it was the sacrament time. She closed her eyes really tight and she said, Heavenly Father, how can I not poke my brother Alex back? And how can I sit here still and quiet? And she had a thought. And this thought was the song. Reverently, quietly, lovingly, we think of thee. Oh, I'm going to think about Jesus Christ. So she kept her eyes closed and she thought and thought and thought about Jesus. She remembered a video she had seen of when Jesus had a supper with all of his disciples. And then he gave them some little bread and water and he told them, this is to remember me when I'm gone. Oh, and that, that was a really nice thought. She really felt warm and peaceful inside. And then she thought about when Jesus came to the Nephites and he blessed all of those children and he just loved everybody and he also showed people how to take the sacrament and to remember him in this way and she just felt so warm and peaceful inside and charlie just loved sitting in that thought and feeling jesus christ lovingly thinking of him and she smiled to herself. She thought, oh, wouldn't it have been wonderful to be one of those Nephite children and to, to look at Jesus and, and to feel his light and his love and have Jesus look back at her little Charlie and say, Charlie, I love you. I love you so much. And I hope that you will remember me every day. Charlie just felt so much love from Jesus and from Heavenly Father. And I even feel that love right now as I'm telling you this story. So Charlie was very peaceful and quiet during the bread. She got through it and she took her little piece of bread and she was so reverent. And her mom and dad were so proud of her. 
then it took a long time for everybody else to take the bread and she started to feel a little bit wiggly again. And her little sister Christy poked her in the other side and she giggled. <laughs> and Charlie thought, I'm gonna lose it. But she remembered, she remembered that her grandma told her that during sacrament time it was important to be as quiet as a mouse. And Charlie thought, okay, what would a quiet mousey do? A quiet mousey would not poke back. She remembered the rest of the song. Reverently, quietly, softly sing our melody. Shari remembered singing the song that they sang before the bread. And she remembered the words to the song. And it was all about Jesus Christ. And she remembered, oh yeah, we, we sang that soft melody. And I remember those sign language that we learned for this part of the song. And it reminded me of petting a kitty cat. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna think of petting my kitty cat and singing that sacrament hymn. And I'm not gonna poke Christy back. And she did it. She sat quiet as a mouse. And she remembered singing the song. And she even remembered singing a few primary songs in her head. Soon it was time for the water. And she thought, I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna stay reverent and quiet for the water too. She thought, well, what can I do now? I've already thought of primary songs. I have thought of the, the story of Jesus and coming to the Nephites and giving the first sacrament. And I'm, I, I remember that he died for me and I can, everybody can come alive again because of Jesus. And so she thought, what else can I do? <sighs> this is taking longer than I thought. She thought of the rest of the Reverently Quietly song. Reverently Quietly Humbly Now we pray Oh, Charlie thought, I can say a little prayer. So she closed her eyes and she folded her arms and she thought about how her week had gone and maybe some of the mistakes she had made during the week. And she thought, well, I can pray about that right now. So she said a little prayer and she said, Heavenly Father, I'm sorry I made some mistakes this week. Can you help me to be better next week? And she felt like she would get that help. And it was nice to talk to Heavenly Father during the sacrament. And she even thought to thank him for Jesus Christ. And that felt really good. And soon the water came to her and she took her little cup and she drank it. And she remembered that Jesus had said that I died for you so that you can say sorry for your mistakes and start over again. And that's what she had just done during the sacrament. So she sat there for a while and thought, okay, what else can I do? What else can I do and why? Why do we even take the sacrament? That's what she thought of next. And she thought, I made some promises when I got baptized and taking the sacrament is to help me to remember those promises. And I think that there's a promise back to me if I remember Jesus Christ. Here's the last line of our song. Let thy Holy Spirit dwell in our hearts today. Oh, let thy Holy Spirit dwell in our hearts today. She remembered those sacrament prayers and it, those sacrament prayers, they all said that my spirit may be with them. Oh, that's, that's very important, isn't it? To always have the Spirit with us to help us to feel that love and to feel that peace and to love other people and keep our baptismal promises. Well, let's sing that song all the way together because this song really helped Charlie to be quiet as a mouse during the sacrament time and to have all of those 
spiritual experiences during the passing and partaking of the bread and water. And I know that the sacrament can be a powerful experience for all of us to feel Jesus Christ, to feel his light, and to share that light. Let's sing our reverently quietly song with our sign language and our actions now. Remember our reverently quietly song in our sign language slash actions. Reverently, quietly, lovingly we think of thee. Reverently, quietly, softly sing our melody. Reverently, quietly, humbly now we pray. Let thy Holy Spirit dwell in our hearts today. Did you remember it? So we make the letter R in sign language and we do kind of a backwards heart. So we go reverently, quietly, lovingly we think of thee. To our R again. Reverently, quietly, softly sing our melody. Reverently, quietly, humbly. This is humbly, like we're going down on our knees. Now we pray, let thy Holy Spirit. So this is Holy Spirit. We're taking something out of our little pot that we've made with our hands. Let thy Holy Spirit dwell. Now we're going to make a heart with our fingers in our hearts. And then today, today, let's sing that again. Reverently, quietly. Oh, I have an idea. Let's try to sing it as softly and as quiet as a mouse that we can. Reverently, quietly, lovingly we Think of thee reverently, quietly, softly sing our melody reverently, quietly, humbly. I know that my Savior loves me. For this one, you will need this page that I attached to your email or attached to the video. You'll want to cut them up into word strips. And then we'll try to put them in order as we sing. But first I want to show you a tapping pattern that we will do with this song. And it goes like this. Tap, tap, one, two, three, tap. Tap, tap, one, two, three, tap. A long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. Each saw the tears on his face. The love that he felt for his little ones, I know he feels for me. I did not touch him or sit on his knee, yet Jesus is real to me. Now we're going to tap our head. I know he lives. I will follow faithfully. Now on your knees. My heart I give to him. I know that my Savior loves me. Wow. Did your hands follow my hands? Now, try to take those little pieces of paper that you cut out 
with the words on them. And these words are not in order and not all the words to the song are on this paper. So I want you to, as we sing this next time around, start to put those words in order. And we'll continue to tap too, because that will help our brains to remember. So tap, tap, one, two, three, tap. And I'm gonna go here and here and on my head and on my knees. Here we go. And remember, if you're a reader, you can start to put those words in order as we're singing. A long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. Oh, so in that one, there were about three words that you could have put in order. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. Each saw the tears on his face. Did you get about four, I think, in that part? Now we're going to go to our shoulder. The love that he felt for his little ones, I know he feels for me. I did not touch him or sit on his knee, yet Jesus is real to me. Ooh. Okay, so that one had about three. Let's stop right here and we'll sing it together and we can put those words in order. Okay, let's try to put these together, together. Let's sing and sing the song. A long time ago in a beautiful place. Do you see anything else that goes there? A long time ago in a beautiful, ah, there's beautiful place. Children were gathered around Jesus. Um, gathered. I thought I saw that. A long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. He blessed and taught. There's blessed. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. There's taught. A long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. Each saw the tears on his face. Aha. Uh -huh. Each saw the tears on his face. The love that he felt for his little ones, I know he feels for me. I did not touch him or sit on his knee. Hmm, there's touch. I did not touch him or sit on his knee. There's sit. Yet Jesus is real to me. Oh, there's real. Okay, let's see what we have so far. <clears throat> a long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. Each saw the tears on his face. The love that he felt for his little ones, I know he feels for me. I did not touch him or sit on his knee, yet Jesus is real to me. I know he lives. Oh, there we go. I will follow faithfully. There's follow. My heart I give to him. My heart I give to him. Oh, I see heart. My heart I give to him. Oh, there's him. I know that my Savior loves me. 
one more time, make sure we've got it all in order. A long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. Each saw the tears on his face. The love that he felt for his little ones, I know he feels for me. I did not touch him or sit on his knee, yet Jesus is real to me. I know he lives, I will follow faithfully, my heart I give to him. I know that my Savior loves me. Good job. Let's tap one more time. A long time ago in a beautiful place, children were gathered round Jesus. He blessed and taught as they felt of his love. Each saw the tears on his face. Let's do our shoulder. The love that he felt for his little ones, I know he feels for me. I did not touch him or sit on his knee, yet Jesus is real to me. I know he lives, I will follow faithfully. My heart I give to him, I know that my Savior loves me. Well, that's our singing time today. Today we sang Families Can Be Together Forever with our paper plates. We also learned about Charlie and her struggle to stay quiet as a mouse during sacrament and the different things that she did to help her to remember Jesus Christ as she took the bread and water. We also um, used our sign language to sing reverently, quietly. And we put together some words in order as we sang, I know that my Savior loves me, as we tapped on our arms and our shoulders and our head and our lap. And we also made a tasty snack of strawberry mousies with chocolate chips and almonds. And that was sure yummy. And now it's time to sing I am a child of God with our butterfly friends, Sister Butterfly. And if you were with me the last video, we made our own Sister Butterflies. So now's the time to get yours ready so we can sing together. Oh, Sister Butterfly, Sister Butterfly, and bring your friend, Sister Butterfly, Sister Butterfly. Oh, here they are. Here's Sister Butterfly and her friend. Let's do our butterfly arms as we sing, I am a child of God together. I am a child of God, and he has sent me here, has given me an earthly home with parents kind and dear. Lead me, guide me, walk beside me, help me find the way. Teach me all that I must do to live with him someday. Oh, thank you, Sister Butterfly, and thank you, Sister Butterfly's friend, for coming and visiting us. And thank you for being with me today. I love you, and remember the Heavenly Father loves you too. Mwah!